Alexander Rodchenko. Six interesting facts. Russian artist Alexander Rodchenko was a leader in many avant-garde movements during a time of great change in Russia. Fact number one. His entire career and body of work is marked by revolution. Rodchenko became one of the most recognised figures during the Bolshevik Revolution, combining art with politics to contribute to communist propaganda. Fact number two. Rodchenko challenged traditional art as well as older avant-garde artists. In response to his rival Kazimir Malevich's white-on-white -white painting, Rodchenko created a series of black-on-black -black abstract paintings. Fact number three. Rodchenko was an excellent fine artist, but abandoned painting. As a constructivist, he worked with a compass and a ruler to avoid creating brushstrokes. He saw painting as outdated and associated it with a capitalist agenda. Fact number four. Rodchenko valued the functionality of design over the aesthetics of art. Eschewing the visual purpose of traditional art, he wanted to create unique commodities to serve Soviet society. He proposed that artists can be engineers. Fact number five. Rodchenko fell out of favour under Stalin's government. The avant-garde movement was suppressed and official art was replaced by social realism. Authorities condemned Rodchenko's art as formalist. Fact number six. He spent his last years dedicated to photography. By documenting Stalin's regime, Rodchenko explored a medium which was highly valued in a country where 70% of the population couldn't read or write. With conviction and innovation, Alexander Rodchenko produced some of the most striking and memorable images which continue to inspire contemporary graphic designers. His creations are true examples of how art can thrive in and shape a fast-changing world. Questions. What do you think of Rodchenko's style of photography? And what about his graphic design? I look forward to our discussions and please review some of the other information found on these screens. See you next time.